2026 is going to be a year of a different kind of MS advances. I'm going to discuss what it means for you, why it's not drugs, and why it's something called biomarkers. But let's dig into this a little bit. These are blood tests that actually guide decisions. We all know that social media is this high level skim and if that's what you need, that's what you need. The detail where we get into the nitty gritty of this is on the Patreon. All the details will be below. Here's the problem with MS care right now. Relapses are slow, MRIs are infrequent and a lot of the damage happens quietly in between. That's where patients get caught out. Being told they're stable, my MRI is fine, while the biology says otherwise. You know it, you hear your body. The key one you'll hear about is neurofilament light chain, NFL, a marker of nerve damage when it's going on. Not as a single number, but as a trend. It's a bit like OCT, it's, it's only good when you have a trend. The rising trend, something's active. Flat low trend, that's a degree of reassurance. The real shift is fewer let's wait and see conversations and earlier, more confident decisions for the doctor and for you. Now, the obvious question is, can I ask for this? And how do I do that properly? And that's where people get stuck and where the wording matters. I've broken it down when it makes sense to raise biomarkers, how to frame with your doctor and what not to overinterpret. That full breakdown, plus a printable clinic checklist, is on the Patreon. If you want the edge in 2026 MS care, that's where it lives.